who were the previous inhabitants of Haven Tor? <laughs> Tor. <laughs> I saw it the first time I saw that loading screen message. My reaction was, don't you get all existential on me, freaking snake pass. Don't try to be Shadow of the Colossus up in here. <laughs> eh. Anyway, we're back. Just had myself some lunch. Made eggs and veggies. It was good. Hello. Oh wow, am I- can I actually, like, just slither out onto the pole? Oh, no, no, alright. It was worth a shot. <laughs> no! No! <laughs> Nearly immediate death. <clears throat> alright, and now, so... Did I already? Yeah, the soggy thing I already said. And so now, this is the water world. So now we've got water! Spoosh. And this is my favorite part of the game so far. I already mentioned how much I like the water because of how like fast and fluidly you move. But now there's underwater portions too. And you can actually go up and down and all around and it just feels so cool. Just swimming around in the water. My only thing is, I wish you didn't constantly slowly float up. Because I feel like that kind of ruins your... Ruins the vibe a little bit when you're trying to swim around underwater. But it's whatever. Oh, oh, whoops. <laughs> and I really do hope that in like the wind stage, or the air stage, whatever it's gonna be. I really hope that there is some kind of, like, flying you can do, like, flying through the air, the way you can go through the water. S -s -s I'm a snake. It's just, it's so nice, just, it's, it's just, it's just nice. I'm trying not to get repetitive. I wish that there were more games that had, like, really fun underwater portions. Because I know a lot of games have underwater portions, but usually those underwater portions aren't actually very fun. Speaking of, I've recently been watching the Game Grumps playing Majora's Mask, and I can't help but wonder well, I mean, not wonder, because I feel like I know relatively, certainly, why they didn't do it, but I really wish that in Breath of the Wild, they would have added in an underwater element akin to the Zora swimming in Majora's Mask, because it just looks like so much fun. Um, how, how do I... there we go. The day a snake learns how to operate levers like this is a day that humankind should be very afraid. I'm a very geometric snake. Sliding a little bit. Is it still, still sliding? I don't know why I'm just sitting here watching him slide. Oh, and this part I like a lot. It's a little... 
don't know what do you call this, Latisse pattern, a little checkerboard. <laughs> you can just go in and out of the little checkerboard openings. And of course, now that I'm recording, I'm not able to do it nearly as well as I was before. You can just... Eh, go. Oh. Eh, eh, here. <laughs> like, I just think there's no actual reason to do it. I just think it's so cool that they put this in. That you're able to just up and down, up and down. Like, I wish that there was actually some kind of reason to go up and down. Anyway, that's enough of that. For some reason, I feel significantly even more, like, out of it than I was before, so I apologize if I start seeming even slower <laughs> than I was before. <laughs> I don't know why I'm suddenly all out of it, but... probably going to be doing a lot of uh, just randomly holding still and not doing anything for a while. <laughs> just because I can't get myself to actually think. done this level and I think like half of the one after this or no maybe no it's this level the one after it and then half of the one after that I believe and that is soggy I guess it's slightly more phallic looking idol there I'm sure I'm the first person to make that joke Also, I almost forgot, I love, like, I like all of this game's music so far, but these, the water levels, are my favorite music so far. I think, for some reason, all music that's, like, water-themed, I love all water-themed music. Like, whenever there's music that's made to, like, emulate water in its sound, that's always... The water song is always my favorite song on the track. Or on the CD. I don't, like I said, I'm, I'm feeling a little slow right now, so don't take everything I say as such. Like, here's when I'll use the grip. Like, to keep myself from falling down too fast. Alright, um... I need to do a little bit better with the... Eh. Tail, yes! I love it when you can grab it with your tail. Mm-hmm. 
Come on. Come on. There we go. Ball. Um. There we go. Um. That. There we. There. There we. There we go. Got a trophy that I didn't get before. Um, before I go up here, is there something else to get? Hmm. I feel like there is, but I can't think of what it might be at the moment. Oh well. Marimba, that instrument. The one that's doing the little. I don't know exactly what that is, but whatever it is, I love it. Is it a string instrument? I mean, I know I hear like a guitar or something now, but that, that's not the one I mean. I'm just gonna stop talking about it before I confuse myself. That, that right there. Like, what instrument is that? It's a marimba or a xylophone or something. One of those hit it with a stick kind of instruments. Oh, jeez. Oh, this is awkward. Alright. Do it again? <laughs> yeah. Oh, this is awkward. I'm holding my breath. This isn't working. There we go. All right. Just like a synthesizer, maybe. Bad snake. Hmm. 
Was I saying something? I have no idea. Rap, 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 rap. And this way. I think that's actually a really cool mechanic, like pulling levers and such with your snake body. did work like I wanted it to. Nice. Oh gosh. I would love to see how like speedrunners run this game, like what kind of tricks they can come up with to save time on the climbing and such. from here. Hmm. Oh wait, that's right. I remembered. Go, 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 slither. Here we go. Oof. So, one blob, two coins. I think I remember where they are. Blob is up here. third one. I thought that was only the second. Yeah, these levels get a lot smaller once you uh, once you've already played them once and you know where everything is. One thing that I would love to see is like if they made a version of this game that was actually like uh if they made like an open world version of this game where there's actually like a world for you to explore and secrets to discover and things like that I think that would be really cool it's like just imagine the things you could do with this kind of movement if they gave like built like a whole world around it. Uh, 
right, and then... There it is. Plop. Um, oh, crap. I wasn't supposed to do that. Whoopsie. When you crash into a wall and your whole body just comes crumbling in behind you. It sounded really morbid to say out loud, actually. <laughs> Alright, let's see. How are we doing this? There's a way to get down there, isn't there? Hmm? Oh, that's right. It's right there. I have to go, like, all the way back down. You know what? I just got a checkpoint. Let's see if we can daredevil this. I am going to regret this decision. How do you like that? <laughs> I have noticed that the gravity in this game is a little floaty. Which isn't a bad thing, per se. Just kind of funny. Hey, hey, out of the way, fuzzy little bastard. <laughs> uh... And just this, the first time I noticed this, I didn't think about it now, but look at this. They've got drums with, like, water pipes above them. And there's just water dripping on the drums and making them go. And, like, that's... Not only is that a really nice attention to detail, that's just a really cool thing. Like, it's just such a cool ambience. Ambiance, however you say it. And it's, it really adds to the game, I think. Like, it doesn't go unnoticed. Or even if it does go unnoticed, it does not go, uh, um, why, why, why was I not, okay. <laughs> it wasn't going forward for some reason. But like, even if, it's one of those things where even if you don't really notice it, it still makes a difference, you know? Even if you, you don't specifically see it and be like, oh, water falling on drums, that's cool. You're still gonna subconsciously like hear it and notice it and it'll still add to your experience you know maybe you don't know maybe I'm not making any sense that's entirely possible I just I like it is what I'm getting at I like this game <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I just had to fight tooth and nail against the biggest urge to go super slithering. <laughs> 
which I guess I ended up just losing because I did it just then, but at, at least I didn't do it, like, unintentionally. <laughs> uh. Alrighty, next level.